Hello everyone and welcome to the Tarot Magicians Emporium. My name is Natalie and today we're taking a look at the Goddess Spirit Oracle Deck. Before I get started, just a quick reminder, I will include the Amazon and Etsy links in the description down below. And if you do end up using one of our links to purchase the deck, we do make a small commission that we use to invest right back into the channel to create more content for you. Now, if you're new around here, this channel is dedicated to all things tarot and oracle decks. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. This is the Goddess Spirit Oracle Deck by Rachel Johnson. In case you want to read what it says. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look inside. Okay, so we have the book and the deck. And we'll look at the cards in a minute. Let's go ahead and take a look at the book, shall we? Okay. So, the book has 72 pages There you have the table of contents All the cards at a glance and some tarot spreads or some some oracle spreads. Very interesting. I always say the best way to get to know your deck is by doing those tarot spreads that they include. Okay, so that's about it. Everything else is um, the descriptions of the cards, which we'll look at at the end, not to spoil everything for you. Um, and then here's just some information about, uh, another deck that, uh, was created by this publishing company, which is, uh, by the way, Blue Angel Publishing. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the cards. I'm always excited to look at the cards. Um... Do that. Okay, so here's the back of the of the cards, and I love it. I love the color scheme. I love these colors. They're they're just beautiful. Um, and the cardstock is very good. Um, it doesn't bend very easily. It's it feels thick. Um, and it has a, a matte finish to the cards, which I actually do prefer the matte finish on, on decks. I think they shuffle much better than the shinier ones. So let's like, take a look at the, uh, at the artwork. First up, we have Earth Maiden Nature. Number two, witch with passion. Number three, shield maiden with courage. Number four, healer, loving connection. Number five, storyteller, expression. Number six, 
Number six, seer, vision, intuition. Number seven, spirit guide, higher realms. Number eight, Sif, free spirit, fertility, leap of faith. Number nine, Isis, magic, manifestation, self mastery. Number 10, Sar Sarasvati, sacred wisdom, essence. Eleven, Demeter, harvest the divine feminine. Twelve, Bastet, independence, protection, boundaries. Thirteen, Danu, spiritual learning. Ascension. Fourteen, Quan Yin, love, compassion, unity. Number fifteen, Freya, warrior, your power, determination. Segment, strength, self-awareness. Number 17, Nematona, serenity, meditation, solitude. Number 18, Fortuna, change, fortune, Outlook. Number 19, Ma'at, Justice, Balance, Fairness. Number 20, Persephone, Introspection, Limbo. Number 21, Hell, Rebirth, Dark and Light. Twenty-two, Coventina, Clarity, Emotions, Harmony. Number 23, Kali, the release of limiting beliefs, transformation. Twenty-four, oh yeah, storms, meaningful destruction. Twenty-five, Tara, hopes, star, renewed purpose. Twenty-six, Shang O, oh, the moon. Dreams, mystery. 27, Amaterasu, the sun, good fortune, happiness. 28, Libertas, awakening, liberation. Number 29, Gaia, completion, 
the earth success. Number nine, number 30, Nike, Triumph, Mastery, Pride. Number 31, Scotty, Authenticity, Truth, Honesty. Number 32, Abnoba, Wilderness, Wild Women, Wildly. Thirty-three, Sigin, Loyalty, Support, Devotion. Thirty-four, Athena, strategy, clarity, intellect. Number 35, Oshun, sweet waters, sensuality, pleasure. Number 36, Ostara. Fruitation, ease, relaxation. Hecate, crosswords, the mystic, discovery. Thirty-eight, iron rod, intention setting and destiny. 39 Diana action focused intent forty Rhiannon the Muse creative inspiration number forty one Celine abundance and romance Number 42, the Morgan, release, permission to rest. Forty-three, X Shell, healing, magic, and restoration. And number 44, Sarah Dwin. Wisdom Banishment. All right, so there you have it. The beautiful art, artwork. I really liked um, the simplicity of the, of the images, but yet they still have uh, symbolism within the, the uh, card itself. Um, very, very beautiful representations. Uh, and that, let me go ahead and shuffle cards. And like I said, I really like how matte decks um, shuffle. And uh, this this deck seems to have a really good quality. Um, just like one of the last ones I did, which I believe that it was the same publishing company. Very good quality of cards. I'm impressed by that. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, just get a card at random so we can look and see how the, the writing is in the book. All right, so we have Celine with Abundance and Romance. So let's take a look and see what it says. This is number 41. And yes, they are in a numerical order, which is very, very handy. And here you have what it says. It says, the full moon, uh, this is from the Greek pantheon, 
and um, it says, Selene is a goddess of the moon. Every night she rides through the dark sky in her silver chariot, and in the morning she relinquishes the heavens to her brother Helios, the sun god. Selene is connected to romance. The full moon is a time of the highest energy and abundance. Reap the fullness of what you have sown and be thankful for what you have brought forth. Take time for romance. If you are in a relationship, eat and dance under the full moon's ray. Um, and then it says, I am grateful for my achievements. Now is a time of abundance. Awesome. So let me know in the comments down below what did you think about this deck. I really enjoy. I really enjoyed looking at this deck for the first time. Um, I like the quality of the deck itself. The artwork is beautiful. Um, I think that this would have many uses and definitely great for that daily practice of uh, throwing a card and seeing what messages the universe has for you, or in this case, the goddesses. And yeah, let me know in the comments down below what do you think. And just a quick reminder, I will include the Amazon and Etsy links for this deck in the description down below in case you're interested in the deck. And if you do use the links to purchase a deck, we do make a small commission from that, which we use to invest into the channel, to create more content, to buy equipment, to buy decks. But if you do want to support us in a non-monetary way, the best way to do that is to like this video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel and maybe even share this video with someone who, might, who you think might like it so thank you so much for your love and support we really appreciate it and have a wonderful day bye bye